Now back to what I was saying before I was rudely interrupted. You know what happened at the end of the month? <laughs> I get back to that. I saw my man, <clears throat> as I was walking ahead to my business, he had a, a, a William Bennett hat on. You never heard of William Bennett? The Oklahoma Thunders. I asked him, have you ever heard of LeBron James? He said, sure. I said, now listen very carefully. You know what makes a person so powerful? He said, no. I said, it's not how big the, a person gun is because I can make a more bigger one. It's not how much money a person has. Because if you know calculus, chemistry, algebra, geometry, oh, I can make, make much, much more money. What makes a person so powerful? As I said to the young man, it's the weak minds that listens. Hey, listen very carefully. I smoked marijuana, but I didn't inhale it. <laughs> That's what makes a person so powerful. The weak minds that listens. Now, it just came to my attention. Why is a well-known champion professional basketball team arena is called the Chase Center? Mm. When the word was given out, it is no donations. All, everything is paid privately, financially. It's all done by in-house. If that's the case, where did the Chase name come from? The Chase Center. Oh, you showing respect to the Treasury? Lincoln Treasurer, Solomon Chase? Oh, where you get the Chase, Chase name from? To call it the Chase Center. So if you ask me, I would say to you that the individual lie. The new arena is not all financially as he stated. Well, let's put him to the test. 16th Amendment. Let's put him to the test. Gotta go.